The first thing we need to do before we get started drawing is to place what I call a cushion onto this drawing board. So what do you need? You need the drawing board that's blank or empty. You need a pad of newsprint so you can take out 12 sheets. And you'll also need your roll of drafting tape. This next part can be a little bit difficult to explain, so I'll try and show you in the video. You would need a dozen sheets, so you count. And you want to tear this off, but you don't want to rip all these pieces. So what some people do is they grab it like this and try to do something with it and nothing happens or they grab it too fast and they get this big chunk out of it like a, a bite. You don't want to mess up the paper. You could do the tearing individually, but most importantly, watch where my right hand is. I move it down when I tear because that's a tension point. Individual sheets tend to be a little bit tougher than a few more sheets. Now this newsprint pad is pretty much a disaster right here. But I will attempt to do more than one sheet. And we'll see what happens. So it was a little bit difficult. It really depends on the glue that binds this paper and all the different brands are a little bit different in the way they manufacture the binding. But I do have them all intact. That's the good thing. So the final part of this is pretty simple. You've got your tape, you've got your paper, you've got your board. You want to place it like so under these clips. You don't want the paper over here because you're going to cover the handle or too close off that other side. So you look for some evenness all the way around. You make sure that it's straight. That looks pretty good. We take a long piece of tape. And you can cover about a third of the paper or half. That covers a little too much, but I'm glad I'm taking it off because I want to show you why this tape is better than masking tape. Because that came right off, as you see. So again, this is about a third to half. You don't want too much tape on the paper because this might affect the drawing that you put on top of it. What I like to make very clear is that you aren't actually making marks on this. This is just a cushion. So you'll add individual sheets. You'll slide them in there. So there's the final product. You can see that on this style of board, the clips are different compared to the clips on this style of board. So it's a matter of personal preference whether or not you put some tape all the way up there, but you're securing it with these three major areas and that should be just fine. And then finally, again, just to remind you, an individual sheet will go inside this here, like so. Of course, we'll do both clips, but you can easily let the paper get out. 